mimi siezi niliwa na yeah, mama sana. mwenzangu yeah. yeah you see that's one thing that does, does it, is it to uh, not from the other side from your side right now if uh, you are going to uh, you want to be elected as the school head girl or class prefect or dorm prefect and things like that are, are your friends going to support you and say now this is a woman that is going to be very passionate proud Ama, does it happen in your circle uh, from where i sit not no. uh, i don't want you to speak for the likes of Martha karua and all that but just down here with your teenagers it doesn't happen it doesn't? so the the your notion that women hate one another and they are their it's, own enemies it's the uh, the elders <laughs> like the elder women <laughs> and you think it has been created by us people and uh, people who are probably the older generation yes, something like that yes. so you don't uh, it's not something that happens yeah it won't happen to our generation why how is no going to happen you're going to prevent it how yes by <laughs> explaining to them by um, making my foundation effective mm -hmm. by yes <laughs> <laughs> So in terms of, uh, you, you know, uh, women leaders, let's just talk about women leaders and how you see perceived representation right now in the country. When you look at women leaders, w what does that make you feel as a 15 year old? They're strong. Mm -hmm. Yes, they're strong people. Mm -hmm. Does it give you reason and gas you up to, you know, want to be there someday? Yes. Huh. Who are you looking up to? Apart from, I know you said in media, uh, it's Victoria, but in terms of leadership. Okay, I don't want to enter in uh -huh. much in, pol in politics, okay. but I usually say that if you can, if you can rule people, mm -hmm. then you're strong. Mm -hmm. Yes. And you are the head of a foundation. You are strong. Yes, I'm the CEO. 